A big oops by the CIA. Officials say agents accidentally left explosive material on a Virginia school bus, a bus that actually drove children around with that material still hidden on board. National correspondent Suzanne Malvo has more on how this happened and what the CIA has to say about it. Suzanne? Pam, it's pretty alarming. You can imagine how the parents of those kids who were riding on that bus re reacted. They were absolutely shocked. Now, these students had been riding this bus for two days before this explosive training material had actually been found. So here's how it happened. This is according to Loudoun County school officials and the CIA. Last week, the students were on spring break. The CIA was using the bus to train its canine units who were trying to figure out how to detect these explosive materials. Mm -hmm. Those involved in the training inadvertently left the explosive material on the bus. So when the students returned from the break, this is Monday and Tuesday, the bus transported 26 students from two elementary schools as well as a high school, made eight runs logging about 145 miles. It wasn't until Wednesday that a maintenance worker doing a routine check discovers the explosive material hidden in the bus's engine compartment. That is when Loudoun County Fire Marshal, the Sheriff's Office, was notified as well as the CIA. An email goes out to the parents and the staff members last night stating that this explosive training material was, quote, in a benign state and could not be activated through normal operation of the bus. Just watch. In the state that it's in, You'd have to have a blasting cap or something to actually make it explode. That was not the case. We partner with law enforcement to allow them to train, first of all, to get to know our schools in case we have an active shooter or some kind of emergency like that. So, Pam, they're trying to put everybody at ease. The CIA releasing this statement today saying to prevent such incidents from happening again, CIA has taken immediate steps to strengthen inventory and control procedures in its canine program. CIA will also conduct a thorough and independent review of CIA's canine training program. It has performed a full inventory this morning and accounted for all the explosive training material used. Wow. I, I imagine that was a big shock to the parents, but glad <laughs> everyone is okay in this uh, situation. Suzanne Absolutely. Malvo. Can you imagine that? <laughs> no. And that the, the inspector who <laughs> was looking at out. the bus finding explosive material. It, just an incredible story. I have to be honest, when I first heard it, I said, was this an April Fool's something or rather? But yeah, clearly you really it think wasn't. it is, right? Unfortunately, it's not one of those April Fool's jokes. Oh, but my goodness. They say they've taken care of it. We'll see. All right, Suzanne, thanks for that. Appreciate your sure. reporting there.